Hello, my name is Gianfranco Giacchetti. I'm the director of flight operations at Volotea. Uh, on behalf of uh, Just Planes and Volotea, welcome you on board today. Uh, thank you for joining us. Um, Volotea is a company with a operator certificate from Spain. Our base is in uh, Barcelona and we have airplanes at uh, two cities in Italy and France. We started our operation two years ago in April 2012 and uh, at the moment we are uh, starting our uh, third season where we plan to fly to 52 airports with uh, 15 airplanes. We are growing at a rate of three to four airplanes every year. Uh, so our hiring department is uh, always very busy, hiring 20 to 30 crews every year. Our operation is a little bit different from others also because we operate to very special airports. Uh, from the 52 airports uh, we will operate this year, uh, 11 are what we call uh, Category Charlie Airport, Category C in Europe, which uh, are airports uh, that require special training from the crew and a special experience from the, uh, from the captain. We have 70 crews at the moment and uh, from 15 different nationalities. So we are always uh, looking forward to receiving uh, applications from pilots from uh, all around Europe, basically. With me today is uh, First Officer Chesney Morel. Uh, he will be today with us in four sectors. And I would like to invite you to have a look at, um, at our walk around. This little thing here is the blowout disc for the oxygen pressure for the, um, for the cockpit. If this is green, that means everything is okay. Over here we have the brake wear pins. These are more than enough. Only when the brake pins are flush, that means we have to reinstall new brakes as they are worn out. So this is a refueling panel. In this part here, they would attach the actual refueling hose where the fuel goes inside. And these are the refueling valves, which are open to send fuel to the right main tank, the left main tank, and the center ring tank. Well, look out, one, two, three, four, clean for takeoff, for zero, four, right, when one, five, zero, ten knots. You have takeoff, zero, four, right, but they one, two, three, four. I have controls. Ready? Ready. All right, let's go. Auto flight. Flight. Check thrust. Thrust set. Need it up? Check. V1, VR. Positive rate. Gear up. Gear up. first. Well, there, one, two, three, four, Venezia, buongiorno, retard counter, continue climb to 5,000 feet. Hello, uh, my name is Nikki van der Heeft. I'm the first officer on this flight from Reggio Calabria to Venice. Uh, I'm 24 years old at my training on the Piper Warrior and Piper Seneca. And I decided to become a pilot while my, my, both my parents are in aviation, not as pilots, but in other sides of aviation. And so th one day, one of my dad's colleagues took me for a flight in a Cessna 172 and I loved flying, so I trained as a pilot and now I worked for Volatea for one year. Well, hello again, everybody. My name is Chesi Manel, and I'm your second officer for this flight. Currently, we are en route to uh, Bari, and I would like to uh, introduce myself to you. Um, I joined Volotea about one year ago. I'm currently uh, 22 years old, which is pretty young to be um, in the right seat of an, uh, of an airline. Um, for the moment, I'm enjoying this job very much, and um, I know a lot of you people um, will be probably thinking and wondering um, how to get into an airline, how to start flight training yourself. So I started just like you. I started watching videos of just planes when I was about uh, 12 years old. Um, and I've been watching videos and playing flight simulator basically all my life. And then I finally made the decision to start uh, flight training um, back in Brussels at Sabina Flight Academy. To all the people who are currently thinking about um, choosing this career, or are currently unemployed and looking for a job, I would say don't give up because there are companies hiring at the moment, especially like this company, Volatea, which is very nice, uh, very young people. Um, I would say the nice thing about this company is that 
Um, we have very experienced, um, very experienced uh, captains and very experienced crew. Uh, with a lot of flying hours, and then on the other hand, we have the uh, first officers, which are quite young. So this is very nice. We are all based here together, like me and Venice. Um, and I think everybody is about 25 years old, more or less, 25, 27. So we are really uh, all together in the same situation, and this makes the atmosphere in this company very nice. We are doing a lot of flights to the Greek islands, and I think this is a good thing. Greek islands means there's not a lot of ILS, it's a lot of VOR approaches a lot of uh, NDB approaches. So there's a lot of manual flying, there's a lot of uh, non-standard approaches, and as well as category C airports, which is, um, needs some special qualification. So it's, uh, it's a good school to start, it's, it's very good. Uh, compared to starting on, uh, for instance, let's say you start on an A330 with another company, you might be flying autopilot your whole life, and as company we really have the opportunity to learn, to practice and to fly manual. Really, if you're interested in choosing uh, your life as, um, as an airline pilot, don't give up and pursue your dreams, because dreams do come true.